Hey fellow content creators, this is your boy Kaxo M with another video. Today in front of me I have the Godox CS65D and this is a Lantern type softbox or a Lantern light modifier. So I just want to show you what it comes with, how does it look like and how to assemble it. So let's not waste time. It comes in this box and it's actually written CS65D. The 65 is actually the size. You also do get 85D um, from Godox. So it's a little bit bigger. The back itself, it's a little bit or it feels a little bit uh, stronger than the previous uh, bag that I had from uh, Godox uh, light modifiers. So it's a welcome improvement. So let's open it. I've actually already opened this, so that's why it looks like this. It's actually nicely folded. It's just me. I cannot fold it nicely. So let's say first you get, um, I will call it the structure, uh, which actually will be covered with the modifier. So I'm not sure what material is this, but it's so flexible. In fact, inside it's a steel rod. I didn't check it first. Um, it's a steel rod, but the steel is very flexible. And outside, this material looks like, I'm not sure, it's woven. Um, anyway, it doesn't really matter, but it actually is very flexible. And I think it will last uh, because you actually have to compress this. You have to compress it. Uh, so that it can fill uh, the, light, the, the, the modifier itself. So we will do that. And this is the modifier. And the modifier is actually same as the other uh, Godox modifiers that I have. Um, I believe it will last because the other ones lasted. I've actually sold some of them. Um, I was reducing my gear. So with this, I am replacing what I have sold uh, because this is a bit smaller and for me, it's even more uh, com compact. It's more compact. So let's see, how do you actually uh, assemble this? So before I put a modifier around this structure, all you're going to do is put it inside this modifier, compress it until this hook, this is a hook, hopefully it's visible, uh, until this hook go as far as this. So this is where it's going to hook. So let's do that. I'm alone, if there was someone who will just have the camera handheld and it was going to be simpler. I just want to show you So this is the centerpiece and this is, this is where I'm going to line my strings. So all those, it's where I'm going to line my strings and just compress it. So let's go again. Okay, the up plus minus there. And just make sure that just make sure that this velcro um, they are not closed. Just open them. Okay, there we go. All you do is it's actually quite simpler if you are on the floor. So all I'm going to do is compress. So what I've seen earlier, uh, I've assembled this before. You find that these rods they actually go inside. But now it looks like when I compress all of them, they're going outside. So previously I had about um, two or three of them go inside. So I just push them a little bit out like that. And another thing that I should say was that the hook, this long hook, 
uh, what happened it's even now it's not straight so after hooking it on the corner i had to put my hand on here and just twist it a little bit and then it hooked nicely now let's try so this is how it goes it's actually filling up this um just this has a spring action so just make sure it doesn't spring back <laughs> and hurt you so okay let's go Okay, I even think this is dangerous because if anything happens here, it can easily go into my uh, eye, but if it's on the floor, it's very far. So, but I trust Godox. Let's see. Okay, now it actually hooked without me having to um, twist the hook, so... Might not be visible but hopefully you can see in there so this is it and the 65d it's actually uh, referring to this diameter and also the 85 on the bigger one it re it's referring to the diameter the, the bigger diameter because this is more like a sphere um the nice thing with this is that you can also put a skirt here. So this is Velcro. You can buy the skirt separately and you can completely close this side part. And also with the skirt, you can actually uh, close half of this. I'm, I'm actually going to do another video with the skirt and just show a few ways of using the skirt. So for now, I think just knowing that you can buy a skirt to close the sides, um, if you don't need light spilling on the sides, uh, but you can use this if it's an interview and you have uh, people sitting around, then you can just have this, you're having light going uh, in all directions. So with the skirt, you actually go into direct it um, at one direction. So this is it. And this is your normal Bowens mount. So you can use it on most of the lights because most lights use Bowen's mount. You don't need any adapter. So guys, this is it. Thank you very much for watching this video. Um, if you like this, please like it down here and also subscribe to my channel. There's more videos coming. Um, I'm going to test this. I've actually bought this mostly for weddings. So I'm out of here.